AG Labs, <clears throat> my name is Ben. Hello and welcome to the micro soldering show. Good morning. Um, yeah, today in the morning, <clears throat> it's the third video in 2020, and today in the morning, we just do that iPhone 6s together. It was mailed in because of, um, because of, I don't know, because of. data rescue it just doesn't work anymore at all she wants a data rescue no problem the first thing we do is like always use our ICC Pro um, for check problems with the dock flex or with TriStar Hydra USB control I see you see this test runs very very fast and now we get a result TriStar Hydra okay so that's good <coughs> If you want to order that beautiful device, you can do that on uh, iccpro.de. And we now just disassemble this iPhone 6S together. And we will just have a look <coughs> where the problem with that device is. Okay. Just open the screws. And we just take our power supply and we got a short on VCC directly 5 amps okay so hopefully <clears throat> this is a fast repair because I have to do a lot of other things today in the morning So at first I have to take a look for my son, for my little son, Frido. Um, he will come to the company in some minutes because my wife got a date at the tattoo artist. <coughs> so I have to take a look for my little son only for about an hour and then he goes to the grandparents and I can do my work again here. So let's just see where the problem with that beautiful device is. We just want to get the data out of it. The year starts like the other year ended before a lot of data rescue jobs a lot of shorts and a lot of swaps and a lot of access and access max and xs got a lot of repairs in here and i have to get them all done finished So let's get out the board. Yeah, we take the terminal to check what we got here. So let's see. Okay, front side. Okay, we take we peel up the stickers at the back side. Peel it up. Peel it up because I want to see where the short is. Come on freaky little little sticker okay this is the queue which is heating up but nothing more okay and then 
<clears throat> we just need to, to take the shield on the front. Shield on the front. Get up, get up, get up. And here we are. That's okay. Take the board again. Okay. Shield on the bottom. Normally these shorts are felt much faster. But in this case I really have to take up all the shields because I didn't see a cap lighting up until now. Come on, this shield really needs some more power to get it up. But that's pretty okay. Come on, baby. It takes so much heat until it wants to come up and here we are. Okay. Just cool down a little bit so I don't get problems with my fingers. After that, put it right under the thermal. don't see anything here okay that's pretty interesting okay that's really interesting the only thing okay perhaps perhaps in some cases long time long time I had seen Another thing like this. Crazy. Back in the days I often had these shorts. And here we are. I just didn't saw it. Here it is. Just one cap. Next beside. Next over the top to the baseband CPU here we are on the front okay 
Sorry, I didn't saw. I really didn't saw it because I just moved too fast. But it's okay. Just took out all all you can imagine. And we go straight to the microscope. And you see that the cap looks pretty normal. You don't see anything that the cap. Got, got a problem. Okay. What can we do now? You just take it out. But I don't want to rip pets. So I just heat it up a small bit. Take it out. And the short should be gone away. So let's check if we can get the important data now. So we go straight on hands, connect the screen. Connect the screen, checking our only iPod Max and let's see if this works and we got a boot boom back to life again really really fast thing just searched some minutes some minutes longer than normal because the short was on the on the front side at the bottom and I didn't saw the cap um, right away so I had to search it a little bit but not a problem at all just a little little VCC main short on an iPhone 6s so we couldn't start the phone anymore at all we couldn't access uh, the data and now we can just get the data for the customer and he will be happy and I'm happy too if the customer is happy I'm happy too so I think um, that's that's the key for for success. If you got if you got an, a happy customer, okay. If you want to learn things like that easily, you can do that at the Bottle and Repair School Germany. And if you are working at the repair industry for smartphones and tablets, you can just uh, join our Facebook group, Smartphone Repair Group Germany. Um, I would be happy to see you there, but please answer the questions. Otherwise, you can't be accepted. So many people want to join the group but don't answer the questions you have to work at the smartphone repair industry or tablet repair industry no private persons and you see the phone is working fine again we can access the data now okay i'm out wish you a nice day think on order your icc pro on iccpro.de i'm out boom back to life again yours ben